try to also help her get those lit. All right, the candles are lit. Let's hurry and sing because the wind keeps wanting to blow them out. Okay. Ready? Go. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Hello everybody, welcome back to Carmen's Birthday 2.0. We are up the canyon. We finally found a spot to sit down, have some dinner. The canyon on the weekends up here is insane. There's like a million people up here, I swear. But Yeah, every spot is full. Our typical spot, our normal spot that we like to go was taken, which is unfortunate because that was the spot that we were gonna launch stuff from, uh, the potato launcher. So we gathered up a bunch of stuff to launch tonight and we got a lot of neighbors right here. Hopefully we'll clear out by the time we're done eating and all that kind of stuff that we can we still We have launch. one or two options. We just start launching stuff. <laughs> or two, we talk to the neighbors and just tell them what's going on and see if they're cool with it. <laughs> and if they don't like it, option three is we just shoot potatoes at them. <laughs> just kidding, totally kidding. But it should be a good time. We've got everyone around here. We're getting ready to have some two-four dinners. And then we'll get down to some cake and uh, we'll see what happens from there. All right, Carmi, are you ready for your tinfoil dinners? All right, let's get it started. I cooked the tinfoil dinners at home because I was worried about not finding a spot up here and I didn't want to get a lay up here and not have any way to cook these. So these are already cooked. We got some strawberries for the cake. We got some salad we're gonna have and some watermelon. Also, and right here is the cake. Also now we get to eat them sooner. We did. We went out That's there. true, we don't have to wait for everything to cook, huh? Everything is cooked and ready to go. Is this sliver too big? Is that a pretty big sliver? <laughs> it's a pretty big sliver. How'd you get that? I'm trying to move the wood. Oh man. I'll be alright. Five minutes and you're already hurt. <laughs> Which one should I know? Alright, so I marked these. There's ones that have a little mark on them, like that one. With onion? Those ones have onions in them. The ones that don't have a mark on them, no onions. So, are these all the same, or are they labeled? Oh. Just grab one. So, the ones that have a label on them, can't really see it, kind of cooked off. These ones, here Austin, that's got an A on it. A for Austin. Who made this fire? This is like the worst fire I've ever seen in my life. I think it was Austin too. <laughs> Claire's just getting her tin foil dinner opened up. Too many bugs out here. Hey, get away. This looks so good. It does look good. I'm so excited. How is it, Carm? Good. Unfortunately, the windy road made Carmen a little bit car sick on the way up here, so she's not feeling super great. Hopefully a little bit of dinner and water will help you feel better. You gotta get feeling better, it's your birthday. You still have lots to eat. Cake. Well, I'm feeling just fine. Oh good, I'm glad. <laughs> Carmen's starting to feel a little bit better. She just needed to come over here and sit by her mama, huh? <laughs> and it's watermelon. Her mama and watermelon, and now she's feeling better. Thank goodness, so we can stay up here long enough to have your cake and sing to you and do all those fun things. I thought maybe we were gonna have to load back up and head home. I just have a cramp in my leg. Now you have a cramp in your leg? Oh my goodness. It's been a crazy birthday for you, hasn't it? And I was gonna stretch, but then I was like, wait, I don't wanna sit down and stretch on the dirt. <laughs> That's a good point. You finish up your dinner, and then we will sing happy birthday to you and cut that yummy cake. Okay. <laughs> so close. It's one of the best parts about having dinner in the wilderness. We can toss food around and try and catch it in our mouths. Oh. Oh, in and out. Did it go up? Water fry. Dang. Nice. Alright, let's see it. <laughs> yeah, toss it up a little higher. You ready to say go? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Carmen is getting her candles in her cake. Did you count out nine of those? Okay, lighter. Alright, Austin, help her get those lit. I have an idea. Just light Keep one of these. Candles. Keep going, Austin. Light one of these with a wick and then do it. The, oh, those are the sparkler ones. Yeah. That's why I did them, because like 4th of July-ish. 
to give him the cake. Do it, do it. All right, the candles are lit. Let's hurry and see because the wind keeps wanting to blow them out. Okay. Ready? Go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Carmen. Happy birthday to you. I'm nine. Good job. I'm so excited. Kiki. All right, Carmen, here comes the first piece just for you. Yup. Oh, I love this cake. Thank you. You got some strawberries on it? Yes, I do. Okay. Austy. How is your cake? It's delicious. This is a super yummy cake. This is the cake that the kids ask for on each one of their birthdays. The Trace Leche cake. It's uh, starting to get dark, so we're gonna head back down the canyon. Uh, no potato launcher tonight. Too many people around, and uh, we don't want to scare anybody. So we'll have to do that another trip up here. But we're gonna head back down, hang out around the house for a little while, and enjoy the rest of the night. Guys, we are back in the canyon. The kids just got cleaned up, ready for bed. Carmen is just having a few mandarin oranges. Carmon, what was your favorite part of today, you know? Probably opening presents. Opening presents, okay. Which present was your most favorite? I mean, you got some good ones today, for sure. You know, you got the Bettys, you got the uh, Mickey, and then you got the bar, the gymnast bar. I don't know if mom knows this, but dad tried to limbo on that thing, and I do not limbo. <laughs> I think it's the bar. The bar? Yeah, the bar is pretty fun, huh? Oh no. <laughs> Lost the Mandarin Orange. Can't believe that you're nine going into the fourth grade. Is that correct? Oh my goodness. Kids are just growing up way too fast, huh? I know. Okay, but the thing is that I'm sad that next year Claire's not going to be in the same school as me. And I'm going to be the only kid in elementary school. <laughs> I think you can handle it. You'll be running the school by that time. I think it's true. You could be like the assistant principal by next year. <laughs> no? I'll, I'll ask some people, see if we can make it happen. Guys, besides Carmen's birthday, it is also our one year anniversary. We had that first video where we were at, uh, it was called Seven Peaks, or what's the new name now, Tara? Summit Water Park. Summit Water Park, that's right. We were at Summit Water Park and uh, we shot our very first video. It was awesome. I honestly think it was one of our best videos. Don't you think? Yes, if you guys have not watched our very first video, it was Carmen's birthday a year ago and it was an amazing video. I think we're gonna, possibly head back there for our one year celebration. Gonna relive our glory days back at, <laughs> <laughs> back at Summit Water Park. Yes, Carm. I think that we should go back to the water park on Saturday because I remember last year, my birthday was on a Saturday. Oh, really? Well, we will find a day this week that works for me and everyone else and we will go to the water park. We got a busy week this week because Owen also leaves the scout camp. Uh, I forgot towards the end of the week. so. We gotta find that right day, a day that works for me as far as work goes and the other kiddos, but we're gonna make that happen. Guys, we appreciate you hanging out with us today. We had so much fun celebrating Carmen. We're so grateful for her and her fun personality. She definitely makes life fun and exciting. There's never a dull moment here without her. We like her a little bit. Yeah, she's all right. <laughs> So we love Carmen and we're grateful for her. Um, we hope you guys will come back tomorrow and hang out with us. We love you and we'll see you guys back here tomorrow.